talk about foreign policy, it is clear that there are some who believe that the United States would be best served by withdrawing from the global community. I disagree. As the wealthiest and most powerful nation on earth, we have got to help lead the struggle to defend and expand a rules-based international order in which law, not might, makes right. We must offer people a vision that one day, maybe not in our lifetimes, but one day in the future, human beings on this planet will live in a world where international conflicts will be resolved peacefully, not by mass murder. At the end of the day, it is obvious that it makes far more sense to have a forum in which countries can debate their concerns, work out compromises and agreements. Dialogue and debate are far preferable to bombs, poison gas, and war. A sensible and effective foreign policy recognizes that our safety and welfare is bound up with the safety and welfare of people throughout the world. With, as Churchill stated, quote, all the homes and families of all the men and women in all the lands. In my view, every person on this planet shares a common humanity. We all want our children to grow up healthy, to have a good education, to have decent jobs, to drink clean water, and to breathe clean air, and to live in peace. That is what being human is about. Our job is to build on that common humanity and do everything that we can to oppose all of the forces, whether unaccountable government power or unaccountable corporate power, who try to divide us up and set us against each other. As Eleanor Roosevelt reminded us, the world of the future is in our making Tomorrow is now. My friends, let us go forward and build that tomorrow. Thank you very much.